now today we are going for the bone of my bone and we are specifically targeting the nine aspects of life there is nothing before or after this these nine things i'm going to discuss today by the glory of god if you can implement this and rate yourself and also rate your spouse you are going to get everything in relationship perfect once your relationship is perfect the world is going to be perfect for you it's very simple the devil didn't have to deal with adam's uh, source of income the devil doesn't need to deal with adam's anything even health what did he deal with relationship but we just forget everything here i guarantee to you there is nothing you're looking for today relationship will give it to you let me say this even outside god it will give it to you if you are not a christian and you have relationship with people that are non-christians you will make it in that order the only thing you lose you lose your soul every other thing you get but even what we have with god is still called a relationship because one way or the other you need to build a relationship with god and it's one big big fallacies that we peddle people can go on their own way themselves for 20 years 25 years and then all of a sudden i'm 28 i want to get married lord who should i marry latibo you've never had relationship with any god that you call god and all of a sudden because you're in trouble you are calling him guess what there are institutions that are made to let you think this is possible so here you are you can live all you have your life but there is an audio okay i know somewhere that once you step there your answer is done even if you are an ayah killer that you have killed even if you kill the pastor's son but once you get there is a real piano hallelujah they made the institutions look easy and i tell you i'm on this table don't let me even mention it because some of you people <laughs> when i want to teach how to make money online how to make it online for free why why am i struggling if, if i'm making it for free they call them trigger words so you have people in the household of god who trigger you to do things they make it easy it's never easy watch everything you can look through in the bible nobody had anything easy <clears throat> my people church was what he was because of who he was oh there was even a poor man that he brought the ark of covenant to his house he had that because he was poor there is always a reason don't let let me read the bible for you Isaiah chapter 4 verse 6 we're going to start from there because i know a lot of people they don't usually like this the bible says my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge that's the only part we practically know lack of knowledge look at this said because you had rejected knowledge so it's not like you don't have access to it i'm speaking to you now but you are going to reject it so the the destruction is not coming because there is no available knowledge but that you reject the knowledge because it is not something that is self-suiting number one thing that destroys most in the world ahead of pride self-suiting even the pride can go under self-suiting because you love yourself so much that you don't want anything to tamper with what you believe in you don't want anything to tamper with this and we are talking about another person's daughter another person's son so you know if it's yourself enter your bush by yourself but now you have taken another mr lagbaja to the bush because you called the person your wife or your husband now we have trouble you have invited us to your house i mean we no come for this wedding we no buy should be we bought it so it's no longer your wife is now our wife it's no longer your husband is now our husband because now we have to see to it because when something goes wrong in that marriage it spreads back to the community in your colloquium uh, prostitute now somebody give back to them somebody gave back to this kidnapper if everybody had made sure their house is in order we won't have crisis in the street but you have crisis in the street my father did a good job on me that's why i'm here most of us our parents did a good job on us that's why we're here and even if he's a guardian that's why we're here and some people think oh i i did it by myself but no you got that experience that knowledge from somewhere that's the person that god used for you but you could have rejected everything you believe in today to go the opposite and that's why the bible says my people are destroyed because of that lack of knowledge that they rejected look at this it didn't end there in the bible now went on and saying and i will reject thee too so not be only you go reject this knowledge even me i will reject you look at this this thou shall be no priest to me and i no go become anything that means you can't even pray to me again simply because you don't understand what i'm saying so what's your prayer for what most of us are praying for had actually been done but we can't recognize it either in marriage in finance or all and that's why i say i'm going to show you the nine parts of life that you have to grade yourself with brethren grading yourself is level one to ten you are going to write it and put something in there if you think you're number two number ten number eleven don't just deceive yourself because <laughs> 
We'll go through it together. So you can't even deceive yourself. I'll, I'll be here. Hallelujah.